hi all welcome back to our channel in this video let's discuss how to manage employee appraisal using odo 15 appraisal module before developing an appraisal it is necessary to set a minimum time for appraisal from the settings menu of configuration tab here we can enable the appraisal plan option to generate the appraisal based on months we can also ask the employees to fill out the surveys by activating the 360 feedback option. Then click on the save icon after enabling the options. We can generate a new appraisal by clicking on the create icon in this dashboard. Or the users can create an appraisal from the Odo employees module. To check that we can go to the employees module. From this dashboard, we can choose one of the employees. Let me choose Anita Olivo. And in this window, we can request an appraisal for Anita Olivo by clicking on the request appraisal icon here. And you can add an appraisal request by clicking on the send by email. So an appraisal request window will appear. Here we can add the recipient subject and also we can enter a message on the command box. And then click on the send icon. After that, we re redirected to a new appraisal after sending the request. So you can modify the employee details from here. Here we can see the manager's name, appraisal date, department, and the company. Later, we can choose the save icon and also the confirm icon. Now the stage is changed from con uh, to confirm to confirmed. And here inside the uh, appraisal tab, we can see the manager's feedback. So we can publish it for the employees by activating the icon here. Now the new appraisal for the employee is confirmed. Now let's come back to the appraisal dashboard. And from here we can select the employee and you can see that the appraisal for Anita Oliver is confirmed. In this window we can see a meeting icon so click on that and a calendar page will appear. Here we can generate a meeting by selecting a particular date. And in this event window we can add the meeting subject and click on the create icon. And you can also change the time for meeting by dragging the event to a specific time in the calendar. Now let's go back to the appraisal dashboard and you can see that the meeting is scheduled. In the appraisal window, we can see the meeting information inside the planned activities. After attending the meeting, you can click on the mark, a, mark done option here. Now click on the mark as done button. After that, the stage will change from confirmed to done. So we have completed a request for an appraisal through this process. So you can see the appraisal of Anita Olivo marked as done in the dashboard. The user can analyze the appraisal from the reporting feature of the Odo 15 appraisal module. By applying the department from the group by option, you can uh, explore the appraisal, appraisal details of Anita Oliver from the sales section as displayed here. In this way, you can analyze all appraisal from the reporting tab of the Odo 15 module. So the appraisal window is viewable here in several formats like Canton view, list view, gun view, calendar view and also in the activity view. In the Canton view, we can see all the created appraisal that contains employees name, department, dates and possible schedules for activity by selecting the clock icon here.
The left side of the appraisal window displays the company details, department and status. Moreover, each employee's appraisal stages are marked here with different colors. We can also access the appraisals of employee details such as name, appraisal date, final interview, status and company in the list view. It is possible to request an appraisal from the Odo employees module and complete it with the appraisal module. So we can uh, implement appraisal strategies to secure employee performance using the Odo 15 appraisal module. So you can quickly develop a new appraisal request in the Odo 15 appraisal module. So that's all about the video. Thank you for watching.